Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh Hello guys Let me introduce myself My name is Salama Nur Mujahidah You can call me Salama I'm from 2A Mathematics Education In University of Muhammadiyah Professor Dr. Hamka And today I will discuss about Some materials First I will present about Reflections, second about translations, and third about dilations. Reflection, translation, and dilation. Reflections. Reflections are everywhere, in mirrors, glass, and here in a lake. What do you notice? In the first picture, there is a mountain. And in the second picture, Explain us the mountains get reflected by mirror line. Can a mirror line be vertical? We can see in this picture the wing of butterfly get reflected by a mirror line in the center. So so in fact mirror lines can be in any direction. Imagine turning the top image in different directions. So we can get definitions of reflection. A reflection can be thought of as folding or flipping an object over the line of reflection. The original object is called the pre-image and the reflection is called the image. This is some example of reflections reflections in the coordinates plane Re first reflects over the x axis the reflections of the point x comma y across the x axis is the point x comma minus y reflects over the y axis the reflections of the point x, y across the y-axis is the point minus x, y. Reflex over y equals to x. The point x, y across the line y equals to x is the point y, x. Reflections in a point Reflex in origin 0, 0 This is example In a point reflections in the origin, the image of the point x, y is the point minus x, minus y Translation Translation definitions Translations is a term used in geometry to describe a function that moves an object a certain distance. The object is not altered in any other way. It is not rotated, reflected, reflected or resized. Example of translation. Translate the figure down 7. How to solve this? Let's check to the next slide. Example of translation. The way to do this is to take each vertex point individually and count down 7. So the point at 1,5 will move to 1, minus 2. Notice we did not move the vertex along the x axis or horizontal directions. The instructions ask us to move it down only along the y axis. More move the other three vertex in the same manner. The point at 3,5 moves to 3, minus 2. 1,3 moves to 1, minus 4. 3,3 moves to 3, minus 4. Then connect the vertex to draw the square translated down 7. Action. A dilation is a type of transformation that changes the size of the image. The scale factor, sometimes called the scalar factor, measures how much larger or smaller the image is. Below is a picture of each type of dilation, one that gets larger, 
Oh, and one that gets smaller. Dilation formula. D K X comma Y equals to K times X comma K times Y. Dilation examples. We can see in this picture there is a triangle. We will make this the blue triangle get larger in like in the yellow triangle. Let the origins 0, 0, be the center of dilation in the coordinates plane. Let ABC be a triangle in the coordinates plane. The points in the coordinates planes are A is 0, 0,2 and B is 2, minus 1 and C minus 2, minus 2. If the scale factor is 2, then every coordinate point of the original triangle is multiplied by the scale factor 2. Therefore, the deleted triangle will be A dash B dash C dash and the coordinate points obtained are A dash is 0, 4 B dash is 4, 2 and C dash is minus 4, minus 4 Deletion with scale factor 2, then multiply by 2. x, y, it will become 2 times x, 2 times y. In conclusion, refle reflections is flip, translations is slight, and deletions is resizing. I think that's all from me, thank you for your attention, and hope you enjoy my video, wassalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh.